Hi, in this video we're going to show you a tool you could use to check the history of your Wi-Fi connections on your computer. It's called Wi-Fi History View. So it's a free download, zip file, just need to extract it and run the executable so there's nothing to install. So we'll just run it here. So this is just a test computer, so everything happened today. So I just connected to various networks. So you have your event time, your event type, connected, disconnected, association, Network adapter name, in this case it's all the same because it's using the same adapter. Interface GUID, uh, local MAC address, which in this case is the same as well. Profile name, so this is the connection that it's connected to, similar to the SSID. So you can see we got a few different uh, connections here. Uh, type, infrastructure, and some of these columns don't show any information for the BSSID. Then you have your type, you know, 802.11.ac or G. Authentication, what security it's using, and the encryption, if any. Uh, disconnect reason. So, like in this case, disconnected by user, but this one here, just uh, disconnected due to a policy disabling auto connector on this interface. And you have another reason there. Connection mode event IDs, and so on. Then you have some options up here. Uh, if you want to just uh, uncheck some of these if you don't want to see them, change the font, event log options if you want to change how the events are logged, advanced options, load from this system or external file, remote computer, shadow copy if you want to get information from another computer, You have some view options here. If you want to sort it, you could also drag the columns up here to sort. I got the filter, show the grid lines. If you want to uh, export a report, so let's do a report for everything here. So in case you need to print it out, you got that. I uh, choose the column. So if there's some columns that aren't giving you any useful information, you could uncheck them and then also move them up and down. And you could also drag them here to, to rearrange them. And you got your find and select all options and save and properties. So if you look at the properties of this, this kind of gives you everything in one screen. But you could also do this too. Save selected items. It'll put it in the same folder as the executable by default unless you change it. And you can go look at that file and just get everything in one place in a text file. So that's pretty simple, but it is a nice way to see your history of what you've connected to. So if you're on the road a lot and you want to see uh, details about your various Wi-Fi connections, you could do so with this tool. So I will put a link in the description where you could download for yourself and then you can check it out. All right. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.